I'm a magician. I lie for a living. How do I murder someone? Invisibility cloak. Me and Jelly have zero talent. Avada Kedavra. Oh, whoa, oh, oh. whoa. That would be illegal. I still cry every single night. Well, the virus Jelly gave me destroyed my anus. I'm genuinely afraid to continue this episode. I'm sweet. <laughs> Jelly, you don't look so good. Mm -hmm. you, you're not feeling okay. Mm -mm. What's going on? Mm -mm. Buddy, what, what, did, why do you, what, what are you doing? Uh, what, is, uh, what the? Uh, what are you, what are you what doing? Going on? Oh my god. Uh, help! What is happening? Pull it! What? What? Oh! 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 Okay, okay. When does it end? There you go. Jeez. Oh! Oh! Dan, what? What did you give us? Uh, what is this mess? Uh, hold on. <laughs> <laughs> Talk while it's oh, in your oh, mouth. I Talk. Was, I was, speak. I was scared it would never end. That You've that drugged was, uh, me. Uh -huh. What is going on? Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> Was we're, that the first magic trick? We're magicians! Hey. Wait, what did he do? And, uh, I coughed up cards, but you missed it. Oh. oh. <laughs> Too slow, my friend. You've got you to be on the. When you watch the magician. Or, you, or we didn't see it because you were doing it invisible. He's uh, already exposed me already. Yeah, he I, thought, has, I thought he's invited me on the podcast to go easy on me. And he, I, trust me, he has no idea what's going on. I usually. have no idea. And you know what? Maybe, maybe because I don't know, Josh. Can you please introduce our guest here today? Oh. This is Dan the Magician. Hello. Um, wow. Dan does magic things yeah. that are really magical. <laughs> Let's get a round of applause. Stop wow. it. I also went to a uh, Hogwarts. Oh. You did? Just put that one. Where's your wand? Obviously. I didn't bring it with me. You can't do magic outside of Hogwarts. That's a common common rules so. is it is it is it is i just it? i just do tricks outside of hogwarts so this stuff uh -huh. is card tricks although it looks like real magic but when i am in the vicinity of hogwarts i do real magic all right well dan i uh, i believe you're 19 right 19 yeah. you're 19 years old yeah you've got over 15 billion views on youtube yeah which by the way it is more than me, is more than Josh. Yeah, that's quite a lot this of This is a big guy, you know, this is a big guy. And he's only 19. Uh, how, how long have you been doing magic for? Um, so I've been doing magic for about a week now. And in that, uh, <laughs> a long time. Yeah, yeah, I've been doing it for, since I was seven years old, believe it or seven not. Seven years seven. old. So yeah, little Dan, instead of, um, instead of going out and hanging out with friends, <laughs> I was sat in my bedroom. Can't, you guys can relate. It's I feel relatable, like, yeah, man. Yeah, two it's guys relatable. that can relate. Yeah. Sat in a bedroom, but instead yeah. of playing games, I was um, watching uh, how to learn how to do card tricks. So or... magicians and gamers, they're all in the same category. Yeah, right. we're, You we're, were reading Harry Potter. Yeah, 100%. I feel like magicians <laughs> and gamers are the sort of guys that if we were in school together, we'd, we would have been sat in the same corner right, right, with right, each other. Right. Oh, so, sure. so, so is it that gamers get into gaming because we haven't got any friends and then magicians get into to magic because you've not got any friends? Exactly. But when you learned the magic, did that get you friends? <laughs> It actually, yeah, that, because that, I'll be honest, the gaming didn't get you friends. <laughs> well, I feel, I feel like, I feel like gaming, you, well, you must have a friend to game because you need another player. Obviously. Yeah, true. Mm. But um, I feel like when you're gaming, it gets quite aggressive sometimes. So when right. you, you know, say if you're a gamer who's got one or two friends when you're younger, it might might end quickly when you know you get killed in Fortnite or right. whatever yeah, else. I, I sense animosity with gamers sometimes. Like, right. uh, I feel like you know. Have you played the new Harry Potter game? I haven't, and I've seen Oh, come on, I'm it's a magician here. You're listen, sitting with listen. gamers, man. Let, let me ask you a question. Okay? All right, all right. If you could actually play Fortnite in real life, right. literally, would you do that or would you play the video game? Oh, 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 that would be illegal. You're I'm pretty people. sure there are yeah, countries it, that play Fortnite. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, but, 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 yeah. But, which countries, Josh? Yeah, but imagine, <laughs> imagine you, re, you respawn, right? So, like... No. Oh, but, you respawn. They, that's not a thing in most countries. I'm, I'm, try, I'm trying to make the point, Ned, because I'm a real wizard, I don't need to play the game. Uh, oh, sorry. he's a real yes. wizard. Obviously, obviously. Uh, okay. Well, Dan, I feel I, like they don't believe me. I I've got like... a question for you, Dan. Please ask Do me. Do you know why you're sitting here? Um, why am I sitting here? Yeah. Um, because I met Josh in Valencia and uh, <laughs> started started talking to him about watches for hours yeah. and all, you know. Oh, and then uh, watches yeah. for hours. Yeah, yeah, yeah. right. Literally. I bet you knew the time. We actually just we just bumped into each other. <laughs> yeah, that's kind of just how we met. And then yeah. um, you're kind of hard to avoid, though. Did Josh. you? Uh, did you... Thanks, Joe. Sorry, that <laughs> Go was ahead. just unnecessary. Go ahead. <laughs> hey, listen, it's a compliment. You had to ignore. Did my you? Friend. Did you? Uh, did you know what I had done before on YouTube before when you met me? Did you know uh, a slogan? 
Um, the slow go man. I did. I did indeed. Because what? I'll be honest, I, when I bumped into you, I had no idea who you were. The no, first no one else does. Don't worry. Um, no, but I, it's insane because I say that, but I have definitely then seen your videos before. Yeah. And you've got an insane amount of views. Yeah. So it was like, it's a weird yeah. thing. Yeah. Like, it's, it's a weird one because like, I feel because of just, because my content is mostly viral stuff. Sure. Like I, I, I'll get, I'll I wish get. I I could say that. Yeah. The, the times I get recognized <laughs> most, people have like, sometimes I love it when people are like, oh, it's Dan Rhodes, the magician. And then that that's, I feel like only the last year I've kind of started having that. Right. At the very start, it'd be like, oh, I've seen your magic somewhere. Right. Right. And that, that used to be the cover. It's Do just they... like, at one point I've seen, because even if they've, even if they've seen one video, because mm. it's still a short, it's not a long yeah. form video, yeah, but yeah, yeah. still I, I get it, I get a lot more stares where people are like, oh, I wonder if it's him. Like on the train down, there were these, these people like looking at me, the full train journey. And at the very end, they were like, are you the magician? And I was like, yeah, I'm the magician. Showed him a card trick. And then they went, cheers, can I keep this? And I was like, yeah, keep that card. And back. you stole their watch. Yeah, yeah. And I stole... We can't say this on the podcast, but yes, yeah, so <laughs> I told him just before I stole the watch, me and uh, Josh are pawning it after this. So, uh, yeah. Do you actually... Do you... I, whoa! Where's mine? You just, you took it off before. Yeah, you I did. Yeah, yeah, I did. I like, wanted to would you, him. would you actually say that, like, the magic you've learned, mm -hmm. would you be able to commit crimes? Oh, absolutely. <laughs> really? Absolutely. Yeah, 100%. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I've got a funny story, actually. So, like... <laughs> this is, like, the most... Ex that's the one thing I was most excited to ask. No, no. But the thing is... Oh, of course he is. The, the, the FIFA the, the I think he's thinking if the... Uh, I think he's a bit bored of gaming now. Yeah, I think, yeah, I think so. Tired of shooting avenue. people in Grand Theft Auto. Come on, exactly. tell me the thief story. Yeah, all right. I'll tell, you, I'll tell you the thief story. It's a very good one, so I thought I'd leave you waiting. So... Basically, uh, I, I learned how to pickpocket for magic tricks, right? Cool, yeah. So, like, I, I, I do it all the time. Like, uh, I'd be pickpocketing my mum, my dad, just close friends and family. And it got to a point where they were like, we've had enough of this now. Like, because whenever when anything went missing, they'd think I did it. And I'm like, I had to pro, I did do it this Where's time. Where's the remote? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'd, be, I'd be honest, like, but then sometimes I would. So yeah, I was, I was always like doing this pickpocketing stuff when, when, when performing magic yeah. for tricks. So like, I'd plank, I'd plank cards in people's pockets and I'd take things out and go them back. And then one day, I swear on my life, I was walking home from school and I found 20 quid on the floor, right? Okay. But it was in my pickpocketing stage. So I come home. <laughs> It was where in your what? In my pickpocketing stage for, for the magic you know the, tricks. You know the stage of life. The pickpocketing stage. Yeah, yeah, we've all been there. We've yeah, all, we're, yeah. We're, we're trying to learn. All right, so you found twenty quid on the floor. Yeah, you were when, in your pickpocket. When, when stage. school isn't going that well, and you know you, yeah. you, you, you you're questioning life, and you think maybe one day I might need to learn be a thief. If sure. Go with right. It. Obviously, but anyways, we, we no, I, I was learning it for for tricks anyway, and I come home with this twenty pound note, and my mum's like. You've took that out of someone's pocket. And I'm like, mum, I swear on my life, I found it on the floor. She's like, no, you've been pickpocketing everyone, right? And I was literally grounded for a full on week. No. But I did do it. And I still, mum, if you're watching this, I still can't forgive you oh, for that. Because see, see, this is what, see, this is what I'm talking problem. about. If yeah. you get grounded for a week though, can't you just escape, but then you leave behind Invisibility like a, cloak. Sure. Like a version of yourself, you know, <laughs> like when you hide the, the body under the uh, covers and then you, Jump out the window. Josh, you seem to He's want to know a lot about crime crimes stuff, and hiding like, bodies. He's scaring me now. Like yeah. he wants to learn how to uh, pickpocket and how to hide a body <laughs> yeah. and how to. Uh, wow, we. Uh, this might be the. When, when, when he's on crime news, then this will be the clip how that, do, uh, <laughs> that they cut back to. It how do I? Um, Josh, quickly how do I, changing subject. <laughs> yeah. How do I murder someone? <laughs> <laughs> That's the question. It's going to be clipped from here. And get away with it. Yeah. It's going to. Or get away with it. Have you ever watched How to Get Away with Murder on Netflix? Oh, yeah, I have. Oh, yeah. it is incredible. Maybe. It mm. is so good. And you. If if you're a, if you're a, if you want to be a criminal, you know if you learned uh, watch you you is very good for that sort of. Thing. Oh, I've seen that. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, yeah I know yeah, what you're yeah. talking about. Okay, so I want you to do a magic trick for Jelly. A magic trick. Yeah. Oh. And now I know people are listening. I'm scared, um, man. And you're just gonna Jelly. I need you to talk about what you're experiencing. Okay. okay. So this is for the audio listeners, right? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. So Dan is grabbing his his stack of cards. Always oh, playing with it. My okay. Trust, yeah, I'm gonna, I'm I mean, Dan can talk as well, Jay. You don't have to talk all the time. <laughs> Know, like we don't need to hear you all the I time. Actually it's, sorry, like it. it's like I'm a it's like I'm a narrator. It's like right, it's right, right. Over me. I like it. Just, um, actually, could what you, are you gonna do to me, Dan? I, I'll do a trick I'll with do, cards. Yeah, I'll do it silently, and I actually I think this would be quite funny. All I right. won't say a word. You like describe what's going on and what you're seeing. Okay. So. All right, all right. So he's showing me all the all the cards. I have to pick a card. Mm -hmm. I have to pick a mm -hmm. card. I'm just gonna pick 
one in the middle. Awesome. I'm not going to show it to you, right? Don't show me, but could right. you do me a favor? Should uh, I tell the audience what the card show is? Show the audience, don't show <laughs> me. <laughs> not tell the audience, but show the audience. audience. For the audio listeners, the card is a... Got him. All right. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> well, 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 we could add it in after. <laughs> so, so now you've showed the lovely people at home. Sign your name on the face of the card. Not your face, just the, uh, the face of the card. Wait. The face is the... Yeah, yeah, just uh, that uh, Sign my name. Sign your name across it. All right, all right. And then for the watchers, I'm selling it on eBay. My eBay is uh, <laughs> for all the, all the gaming fans. <laughs> okay, uh, I, I He's I like, signed... now sign this card. And now another card. Yeah. And now another card. <laughs> That's my payment for the podcast. Actually, don't mind if I see the card, actually. I'll go one step above. Well, what's the point clubs? of the keeping a secret? Um, I just wanted to add a bit of mystery to it. So people are like, ooh. Six of clovers. Six of clo- Oh, Cl- my God. Clovers? Clovers. clovers. Clubs. Six clubs. clubs. Oh, yeah. it's a Dutch one. Learned Don't worry about it. Yeah. Oh, it's actually. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fair enough. I'll let you. I'll off. teach you guys another language if you want. No, can, we, can, we, can we focus on the magic? Then? All right, magic oh, trick. Boom, boom. Hand. Yeah, six of clubs. Okay. I've got my hand out. He's got it out. Keep it very, very still. You cannot move. If you move, the trick ends terribly, and it's your fault, not mine. And so. I die. Um. Yeah, but don't don't mention Focus. death around this man. There is a don't risk. Get too excited. Don't get me too excited. Six of clubs. Okay. Six <laughs> put your hand on top of the six of clubs. Put my hand yeah, on. Yeah, put your hand on but top. But I couldn't move. Yeah, it's very still, very still. He requires very <laughs> All right, specific I'm putting directions. The card between you my are. palms. Right, I've got the next card, the ten of diamonds. Right? Can everybody see that? I'll this is a still. long trick. It's a very long trick. It would have happened by now, though. Wait, how do I know it's actually the the six of clubs? We've got to hold still. I'll show you. One minute. Dan? Oh, you're signing your name on the what diamond? The ten of diamonds. The ten of diamonds. Yes, just for you. I'm going to gift this to you. I don't really want your signature. I'm just kidding. (laughs) So rude. Just pretend. The short short, short form views are not as good for signatures. Dan, okay. Ten of diamonds. So got my name on the ten. Ten of diamonds. Ten of Danmans. Oh, that was good. I'm taking that. I put it on. Can top. we just say? I don't have life. a third ad to put on there, mate. Oh, I'm over here. <laughs> Josh, wait. Oh, he did something. He snapped. <laughs> I felt a vibration in between my hands. Oh, easy crowd. He's really helping me Ooh. out, making it sound more exciting. Dude, the vibration is killing me. Oh, what is it? Oh look, I've got. Jelly, it's you... the six of clubs that you just put on my hands. You switched around, Jelly. That so what am I... Wait, so I am holding the card you signed. You should be, if this has worked correctly. The ten of diamonds. You can't be, Jelly. You can't be I'm holding, holding it. the ten of diamonds that he signed. I'm holding it. Oh, my God. I am holding it. I don't know how can, this works. Can, can, can you say I'm a wizard, Harry? You are indeed a wizard, Harry. Oh, ho, ho, thank you. And the best part is... Don't I get to keep it? No, 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 no. You, uh, you, you offended me. I'm keeping this card now. <laughs> this is the... Uh, but yeah. I was impressed. Was that, was that one of your first magic tricks? Uh, yeah, it's the first one I've been magicked on. Oh, nice. His first you ever magic You took his trick. magic virginity. I oh. did indeed. Ooh. It is gone. Now you right. guys... You I still don't know how it works. You are you now... here to explain it? No. You're not here to explain it. No. So a magician that... never reveals his... Uh, trick and that's like a proper thing right because yeah, yeah, people yeah. do and don't know that but it's genuinely a proper thing that you can't reveal the magic yeah right. you can't reveal a single trick um unless you give me 20k <laughs> so, so. i'm serious 20 <laughs> grand and i will teach no, no. Uh, to, be, to be honest with you I t- i've taught so many grand. tricks on um yeah but do you just you just tell people the really boring ones. Yeah, yeah, that's that's true. So, like, I always teach the ones that, like, you, you could do at home or, like, uh, right. you could do with household objects. Well, or... this one you could do anywhere. This one? Yeah. Yeah, it's really simple. Right. It's really right. But I, to... I, You know what the weird thing is? The card was stuck in between my hands. It was. And, and were... I didn't feel the card leaving or... I, I don't understand. And that's magic. Too. That is magic. You know, he, that, that snap he did, right? That one right that there? Was, that was where the magic was. It created... Snap. A special force, okay, which Jay. a magician calls... It, uh, the force. <laughs> <laughs> it created an attachment in time, in the space-time continuum. That's Great. how the trick... Like, obviously, it's a very simple trick, but right. I'll explain... We're back on time. You guys I, love watches. Yeah, I'll explain I'll explain in short how the trick works. It all makes yeah. sense. So basically, when I snap, yeah. time stops for like a couple of seconds, right? You really? Because he's, he's in on it, right? I'm he's in on it. it. Just so you in on it. Then... We move your hand and we swap the card and you've been hypnotized without knowing. You have a trigger word, right? So whenever me and Josh say this word, you just freeze. But wait, I'm not going to tell you what it is. No, no you're, you're kidding. kidding. Don't say no, it. like you... What? He just... Have you hypnotized me? I have. Yeah. No! It wasn't, to be honest, it wasn't that hard. You're quite suggestible. 
Some, pe- some people are suggestible to hypnosis, others aren't. And I'm yeah. genuinely afraid to continue this episode. And sleep. And no! <laughs> you see? I'm just kidding. That wasn't the air word. He wouldn't tell you the well, word. Well, I, I didn't hear a sleep before. We can't tell him the trigger word. Yeah, Definitely we won't. Not. We'll keep it to Okay. So, the, on the topic of not being able to, <laughs> like, tell people the tricks. Yeah. How does anyone then learn to become a magician if you can't ever tell the truth? That is such a good question. Yeah, Thanks, this, this is like the, the rebuttal I always give to magicians when they're so annoyed at me for teaching tricks. But I'm like, if you can't teach them, then no one's going to learn. So Right. It's a dying breed at that point. It is. Right? Exactly that. Exactly yeah. that. So, um, yeah, I am. I think I am the last magician, though, to learn tricks. Well, um, you're 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 why? actually lucky why? to be living in a 21st century because to to on the internet, to, yeah, you you'd be burned on stake, like you, yeah, you, yeah. This you, is what I'm saying. Like uh, everyone would think if I, if I were doing this back in back in the day, you yeah, know, back in the day, back in the day, back when these guys were younger, um, ba- I would back have been, when we we were relevant. Yeah, you, yeah, yeah. you were in, you didn't exist yet. No, no, exactly. So, well, no. So actually, back in the day. Dan was on Britain's Got Talent. Oh, yeah. yeah. So I you were on that. a, so effectively for anyone that doesn't know what that is, that's like X Factor. It's like a, a right. talent American's show. American's Got Talent, isn't yeah. that a show? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. The Got Talent show. I, I've yes. got, I've got quite a few questions because I, I watched that a lot growing up. Like, really? how did you, like, how did you even come to get beyond that? Yeah, like, what I, is I'm the curious about this as well. Um, So yeah, basically, um, I think it was like, I saw a lot of, magicians doing clips where they were going viral online yeah and then it was it's, it's weird because i've only just come to realize now that like the way you really build an audience is with stuff that tells a story obviously mm. but like i just wanted to like you know gain followers and go viral when i started how and, old were you at this time um i've been making videos for about almost three years like short videos right that's so so yes yeah, that's it's, not a long time yeah, it's not it's not mega long because um what I do is I just all my tricks that I'd learned because I've right. been doing magic for quite a long time, I just put on TikTok. Yeah. So like at the start of the lockdown, I had like a hundred thousand followers on TikTok. What? And then I grew that. And then when YouTube released shorts, I just posted all my shorts on there. Wow. And I really wanted to do a lot of long form, but I was in two minds because no one when shorts started was sure how long it would kind of last the mad mm. reach, and I just didn't want to like. From a brand perspective, I just thought the idea of, 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 right. of um, you know, scaling that fast was really good. So I just focused on shorts and shorts and shorts. And but shorts. was the Britain's Got yeah. Talent thing before? Yeah, yeah, yeah that's yeah, what I'm wondering. Before, so Britain's yeah. Got, so so you actually you weren't an influencer back then. Yeah. No, no, no. So did TikTok exist by the time you went on? No, it actually, I think it was Musically. Do you remember uh, Musically? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 yeah we, we never probably used that. So, so how old this? were you when you were on British Got Talent? Um, oh yeah, yeah. I was. Um, sixteen. I think. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. So, 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 how did Sorry you get before. onto that? How? What's the story behind that? Um, how I signed got up on... online or? Um, how did I friend get... of a friend? Yeah. Let him reply to. There him. was there was a guy that um, <laughs> is um oh he was it. He'll make how you disappear you... if you're okay. Yeah. Ah! Exactly. Uh, uh, no, Don't say the to, word. I use the trigger word exactly. Oh, yeah, yeah. Um, no, but um, what was I going to say? So. I how did I get on Britain's Got Talent? It's a, <laughs> have you hypnotized me to just make me forget how, I, I also how the have journey a began? I also have a Q word. Oh, does he actually? No, he, doesn't, he doesn't have a, he doesn't, he doesn't right. have a clue Fair. what day it is. <laughs> I'm so, I actually so, don't. So, so yeah, I just uh, I just auditioned, like I emailed them, yeah. and the trick that I did wasn't actually my trick. I hired it. So I did the uh, story in half illusion. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Yeah, 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 hang yeah. On, yeah. Hang on. You what? You hired it. I hired it. How does that? What is you that? hired what? You hired the trick. I hired the trick. What yes. does that mean? No, 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 no. But but wait, let me quickly say this yeah. for somebody who hasn't seen your performance on Bridge Got Talent. Yeah. You went on stage and you said you you brought your own yeah. custom made so cardboard. Um, what is it like? Human I'm, body cutting. I've just realized machine? I've exposed myself. I have. It's never. It I'm wasn't made by you. I lie for a living. You can't blame me. You hired that. So you paid yeah, someone. Yeah, but here, here's my like, here's my rebuttal. Here, here's the reason it's he exposes okay. himself. You know, then has yeah. to. This is actually really funny. Come on, I, I'll let you this. answer. But you yeah. know, the thing about British Got Talent is <laughs> the, the thing is right. <laughs> you want it was like, for the audience, right? Imagine, sixteen-year-old kid comes on, right? Yeah. With his own cardboard box, and he's gonna do a magic trick. Yeah. That seems like relatable and cool. And you just let him pass anyway. No wonder you made it through. Yeah, well, I'll tell you what. So, when I wanted to hire the trick, because Britain's Got Talent came to me and said they want someone to do the Sorry in Half trick on a judge, because mm-hmm. they knew it'd get headlines, right? Uh, what? So they hired it for me. So no! I, I, I didn't have to come out of my pocket. It's getting but, worse. It's getting worse. But I told them if I was to do this trick, that I wanna make it unique. So originally it just said Sorry in a Lady in Half, blah, 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 blah. And I put the cardboard on it, 
So technically, so oh. I put all, so because I wanted to make <gasps> it look so bad that when I actually saw the judge in half, it was it was her. I mean, so, it looked it looked better, but I've got I've got something to tell you. Um, the the Amanda Holden you see now. Do you ever see these conspiracy theories of different shows where they think that the celebrity you know disappeared or they got? A oh clone? wait, you actually believe you killed her? No. <laughs> I saw, I saw. I think I saw it right now. I, 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 uh, For reals? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because, you were there. You did it. Yeah, I did it. I did it. So I think, um, yeah, they, they actually cut and um, they, they fully saved me. I skipped the prison sentence and everything. Uh, <laughs> so but, no, you know, know what's the nerdiest <laughs> thing ever, actually? What? So I watched it and I am I have pretty much the same electric saw. As oh, yeah, that no well, I hope and that the first thing I saw oh. when I did it was you did it the wrong way round. Yeah. So it was, it was the black, it was the that. blunt side that you around. used because you used it like that with the handle like in that direction and the blade is on the inside. So you, you should have cut well, that you, way. Okay. For the last three years, I thought my performance was flawless. And that tree, <laughs> that tree must now be crushed. I just, I had to reveal that. I that had is, to say that it. Is I might be wrong, but I, when I looked at it, I was like, yeah, that's what I have. And that would have just been the blunt side of the blade. Oh, damn. Okay, so okay. I, you don't have to reveal your secrets, but I've, I've had one of these ma magic knives before that once you use it, you just like, it's, it has a oh, spring it retracts, inside. Retracts, it retracts. It, yeah. Does the blade work like that? Um, it's a bit different. It's a bit different. Um, Cause obviously she's still alive. She's still kicking, you know. Kicking. Uh, is she still a jury? Still she's got. I don't know, she but she's jury? got hip problems now. Actually, I can't mention this, guys. There's still an ongoing lawsuit about me sawing a man in half. Uh, a certain. <laughs> well, it was their idea. Semantics it was all and logistics. Lie. Exactly. That's my thing. That my lawyer's going with strongly that it was their idea. Mm. So, 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 so I think so, it's important you say that 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 is a joke because you might actually get drunk. What do you mean a joke? It's a joke. Oh. When you did it, <laughs> Simon Cow bleeped you in the. He did. Yeah. Was that actually, did that actually happen or was yeah. that a dramatic flair? No, no. He, he genuinely buzzed. I did that moment. I was, was that like, planned? No, no, no. He just, I think he was getting bored. Yeah. Because, because like the first two minutes were just like, today I'm going to saw it now. I'm going to saw Hang on, hang on. Like it's, it's completely different with like a YouTube video. You're almost like. I guess as well, because when you think about it, mm. the, with the performance, what the actual thing that happens is so quick. Yeah. Like, yeah. Yeah. So you actually. No, have but to... it's a build up, right? Uh, that's. Yeah. It's yeah, a yeah, that's what I'm saying. That's a magic trick in general. So you, he, right? you think he just bleeped you because you got, he got bored? I think no. he just got bored. He just no. wanted to add a little bit of suspense to it. We'll go I, with that. Apparently, he, he retracted it as well, yeah, he right? Took, he took it off at the end. So yeah. he buzzed me. Thanks, Simon. But then, you know, he took it back and he said, then he, he went back on it and said, oh, you've got a little bit of showmanship. I like the, the style, whatever else. And yeah. he said he did it to scare Amanda, so maybe he did that. But in that moment... He did I, it so that you would <laughs> jolt and cut the leg off. That's to say, he said he was hoping something would go wrong. Um, but in that moment when he buzzed me, I was like, I was literally, I was in two minds. I was like, do I like stop smiling or do I, or do I just keep going? Right. And then because it's weird in person, because when you see it on TV, you're like, but, but it's so loud. Oh, it's really? It's like, like, like... Oh, really? Yeah, and then... I just kept going and then he took it back. Hmm. And uh, now I'm here because I think if he wouldn't have taken it back, I wouldn't well, have kept making videos and I wouldn't oh, have ended man. up on this sofa right now. So, so what, I, I've got a question for you. What happened after? So uh, you made it through, yeah. right? They, they, they loved your performance. They said, you're, you're going you're gonna to continue to the next round. Yeah. What happened to this next round? Because I don't think any of that has been on TV. The right? next round never came. Um, so because they staged your performance, yeah. they well, just basically kicked you out straight well, away after. Uh, I don't know if it, I could say it was stage, but it was like... Well, it was they, a stage, but they... Yeah, they, they, they wanted the trick. Idea. Yeah, yeah. So I think sometimes with BGT, even if you get four yeses, you're not always yeah. necessarily through. But uh, I'm kind of... I'm kind of glad it went how it did. And uh, sometimes they ask me to come back, like some years. Really? Yeah, yeah. And you haven't done it yet? No, no, no. Why? I just like... Um, it's good for your brand, like right? For it I, anymore. Think, I think maybe you're you're too elevated now. I feel like it wouldn't be fair. Like if I, if I, oh, you're giving them exposure then. No. It's not that. Like well, I'm, you're like an actual professional. Now. Yeah, like I could yeah, make right, ten right. videos saying vote for me. Then is that fair if I won? Oh yeah. Right, right, right. But still, though, what happened to this next round? So, how quickly did you find out that you're actually not going to continue to semi? Continue uh, to semi it was a couple of weeks after. Oh, okay. I yeah. thought it would be like ten minutes later. Yeah, no. A few weeks later, they just said, um, "You're not through to the next round." Um, there was no second performance. There was. There was none. There was none. Um, just in my bedroom when I was thinking of the idea. Did you cry? Did I cry? 
I still cry every single night, you know, just <laughs> just thinking what would have happened if I would have gone part two on, on BGT. Jenny cries every night just yeah, for yeah. different reasons. So do mm. you, you don't even lie. We all we're all crying. I've never yeah. cried. I can see it in your eyes. You I, there's nothing I can behind, hide my tears. My it's eyes. one of my special magic tricks that the, I actually the, the, This needs you. to be a goal to make him cry on one of the podcasts. That's, t- you really need to I'll touch him. That. You need to think of Don't something. Touch just, talk about, just say something <laughs> happened to his dog. Something messed up like that. Oh, no, I'm kidding. That is brutal. <laughs> All right, I, I tell you what. I think, <laughs> can we get, let's lighten this up. We, need a, okay. we want another magic break. A magic trick. Oh my God. Magic break. Magic do you have another one up your sleeve? I actually do. They usually keep cards up there. You should check your back pocket, Jelly. Wait, where's the You're Sharpie kidding. gone? We've lost the Sharpie, There's nothing there. gentlemen. Where is it gone? Oh, the Sharpie. Uh, well, it's in you, your back pocket, Jelly. You gave it to me, and then I kind of, I don't know. You gave it to him, it. he made it disappear. He's the real magician. Where's the Sharpie? Oh, here's the Sharpie. Hey, hey I told you. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Got him. Okay. He's, he's tricking the magician. <laughs> I'm tricking the magician, he's man. He's tricking the magician. I'm a wizard in... Uh, Disguise. Yes. Is that, would, that, would that ever be like your side hustle? What? A in wizard? Magic. I don't. I think Jelly is would never be able to do magic. Why? Because he's just he's not got the attention span. (laughs) To be honest, I haven't got the attention span to learn new tricks anymore. TikTok has ruined you, violated my attention span in real time. Wait, you're doing a trick with one of your rings? Yeah, I'm doing a trick with a ring. Okay, the ring. Yeah, so I got to describe this for the audio listeners. He's put a ring on a sharpie, and it's like floating around. Um, Oh. There we go. It's I think back. I'm a little. Uh, I think I'm a little bit too close. I can see what's happening. No, that's the point. You're not going to say. <laughs> I knew, I knew, <laughs> this is what I'm talking about. I knew, be, I knew be able to see from this angle. They can't see All from right. this angle. You honestly, you've got to, you've got to Let's inform go again. him. We'll pretend. Yeah. Okay. 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 We got a ring. Yeah. Okay. Uh-huh. Watch very closely. Whoa! Let's put a ring around a sharpie. Oh, oh. oh my god! It's float. Oh, hang it's on. floating. Stuck. It's. Where a bit of static. Could you hold out your finger? My finger. <laughs> I'm really confused. This doesn't know how. So the ring is, is stuck to the sharpie. He's blowing on it. He missed. I'll go again. We'll, we'll go again at this bit. Can we cut this? We'll go <laughs> yeah. I want it to land for the perfect visual. Yeah. All right, so all right. We'll, right. we'll do it. Yeah. I'll put my I'll put my finger a little higher. So we'll take the ring. Watch uh-huh. very closely. We'll get a little bit of static electricity. That should be enough. Did you see me get it? Static. Watch. No. Yes, I heard it. I heard the oh, okay. static. You heard yeah, it. You I heard, heard it. the. Yeah. <laughs> Oh. Whoa! It's it's it. The ring st- is oh. on the opposite side of the sharpie. Wait, watch, watch. <laughs> ah! <laughs> Good job. This is a lie. <laughs> One more time. Do we know how to cut stuff out? Can I press my buzzer? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we'll do one more. This this one will work. My oh. hands got sweating. I was like, oh, my grip is loosening. Don't worry. Right. So we've got a ring. Right. This is first time. Watch the ring. Mm-hmm. Three, two. The ring on the wand. Oh, hang on. It's floating. Oh, it's stuck. Oh, wait. It's not coming off. It's not coming oh. off. Oh, there it is. Wait. wait. Push it. Tell you what, could you hold out your finger? All right. Right. Hold very, very still. Hold very, okay. Very still. I'm terrified. Oh! oh! And watch. It's gone. What? Whoa! I actually genuinely <laughs> didn't see what happened there. Where's the. Up your sleeve. I want to know what how many things are up your sleeve. It's not up your sleeve. If you look very zoom in very closely, there is a. <laughs> oh, there it was. <laughs> that's that's a different sharpie. That's not, oh, that's I think when he it. rolled up his sleeve, he grabbed it. But it's all right. It's all right. So, I'm not. I'm not revealing any tricks here. But am I? Am I keeping the ring? Absolutely not. <laughs> this was my great 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 granddad's. Was what was his name? Um, Merlin. <laughs> The, the, the great wizard. Not, not the. the uh, I was going to say that'd be what quite a coincidence. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, I am a descendant of the greatest wizard of all time. <laughs> That's why it took ten attempts to do. So, do you like? Do you get it when you do tricks a lot that people try to disprove it and try and like mess with yeah. it all the time? Hecklers. Like me, I'm annoying. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Je- you actually, not, I like hecklers. Hecklers. You know I mean? Oh, so you like That's the, the way word. I'm responding? Yes, yeah, yeah. Okay. But, um, but like, I kind of said no one ever. <laughs> said no. Heckler. Heckler. Have you heard that? I don't think before? anyone has ever said that they like the way Jelly's responding about anything. But oh, thank you, Josh. You'll, 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 I... you'll, you'll get tired of it. <laughs> <laughs> um, but no, like a heckler is essentially someone who's trying to figure out the magic trick. Yeah. But I always say like at the end of the day, it's entertainment. So yeah. like, in the same way, you wouldn't go and watch a film and be like, this isn't real. I'm leaving. Yeah. Like a magic trick. It yeah. isn't real. 
for well but it's like their perception because i think yeah. the whole point is that you convince someone for a split second i think it's just creating that that idea of wonder so what do you how do you work around someone who's like heckling you and messing you up like what do you do you do anything different when you get those types yeah, of people i just look them right in the eyes you didn't like this and i just go you're really cool <laughs> <laughs> then that's it and then that that one normally does the trick so then they well, normally stop i feel like a good magic trick like if you partially reveal it it leaves people wondering even more and that makes it better yeah i feel like if someone you know I mean? really really wants to learn the trick then there's nothing to stop them from like teaching right. them but because there's some people who just don't want to learn they're like i want to just keep it as a, as a magic trick yeah all the people are like i want to learn how that works because people's minds work differently some people want to figure out like the intricacies of different mm. things and other people are happy to so you've got the hecklers and then what and then is there like a different group of people who just want to mess with you because not ri- to be do honest, you remember when I messed, did you remember when I messed with you in Valencia? Because I'm oh, very proud. Oh, I actually want to yeah. hear this story. Yeah, how you it's guys. not that big of a story. Oh, I just, come on. So we were we were in Valencia. Um, we were at like a YouTube event. Right, yeah. that's where me and Dan met. I yeah. was invited to. Yeah. But I didn't go. He didn't come. It's, exactly. This isn't about you though. No, Jill. I know. I was. So, I could have met Dan. Why though. didn't you come? Uh, I don't remember. I think I was somewhere else. Somewhere I had another else. trip planned. Yeah. Fair enough. Yeah. yeah. Next time. Perfect excuse, Jay. <laughs> Yes, sir. <laughs> Actually, you have to pinky promise on the podcast. All right. Next time, Valencia. Okay. Let's make it happen. Let's get on to the story. Yeah. So, w- yeah. So after we'd bumped into each other. Yes. We were with some other YouTubers and yeah. some cool people. And you were showing off just some different magic tricks. And I, as the kind of the asshole that I am, I was like, I want to try and mess. With- <laughs> I'm definitely not like a heckler. I'm, no, no, I'm no. super respectful. Mess in the middle. But I like to, yeah, oh, I like to be mess, mess around yeah, a bit. Yeah. All right. So what I did was I, Dan had left his pack of cards on the table. <gasps> so I selected one of the cards out of the deck and then I left it. I left it for a good little bit of time. Yeah. yeah. And then I said to Dan and I was like, I can't remember, I was with someone else. And I was like, oh, Dan, can you do a magic trick? Oh, is there one you can do where you like? I have to like pick a card. Yeah. <laughs> oh wait. And I had the card yeah. that I was going to pick, and I put it under my butt or something like that. Yeah. And um, <laughs> and I, I don't know, like, because so, you kind of change your tricks depending on what you want to yeah. do, right? Yeah. So like, I'll improvise quite a lot. But I think you <laughs> named the card, and then I started looking for it. Do you know what was so funny? I think I was gonna like act like it were part of the trick, take oh. the credit. It's like, yeah, you've just named a card and it's not in the pack. Magic, done. But then, <laughs> then you revealed it. But, it but no, no, no. First of all, you were like, I think, yeah, you nearly, maybe you were going to do that. But then you, I think you were like, wait, actually, do you like see the card? You, you, it, the yeah, magic stopped. Like, and you're like, wait, no, 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 no there's no deck. card in this. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and yeah. you even said to me, you're like, do you see the card now? I'm like, no. Yeah, no. <laughs> wait, so, he, so, he played it pretty good as well. He's a good actor when he wants to. Like there was when someone's tricking you, there's normally a little glimpse of like a smile. Well, they get excited. Yeah, they yeah. get too excited. Like, so you let him win, basically. No, no. Well, no. He's saying he didn't notice. Definitely not. I got him back. I put a I put a card in his when he was asleep in his uh, pillow, right? And I did a magic trick the same night where I got someone to pick a card and I told him to check his pillow when he got back. Do you remember? And you was blown away. Um, what? That wasn't to Josh. I think that, that must have that been didn't asleep. happen. That was a uh... no. That happened in my dreams. I, I had to. I had to. I had to. <laughs> I, had to I think I had to buy as well. I had to make it up because I think he, he's he's one up me. Okay. Yeah. He's, he's got me with something. So yeah. I feel like. And yeah. maybe I've done it again today. Next year at oh. Valencia, man, I'm gonna. Yeah, yeah. Well, this back. is why I'm convinced now that whenever Dan's around, I'm always. You got to check your pockets because I feel oh, like he's going to slip. You, you told me heart. earlier to check my pockets, but there's not there's nothing. Did right? you check your pockets? No, well, I didn't. <laughs> this could have took I, his wallet. There's, there's nothing. No, nothing left in his pockets anymore. There's nothing there. Not in the back ones. I'm not missing anything either. No, I didn't put anything there. I'm just oh come on! I was really it, it, there was a suspense there, you know. Yeah, but anyway, <laughs> that's the story of me messing. Wow. Have you got any other stories of anyone like messing around with you or like, <laughs> or stories where? Because I think the, the natural thing about being a magician is you're you're constantly one-upping people right mm. like it's kind of you're you're kind of always in charge do you have any sort of examples where it's gone wrong like on a bigger scale and you've had to go oh i need to fix this or i don't know what i'm gonna do um, or do you kind of just hide those like things? on a stage i guess right like to be honest when i've messed a trick up i like i make it seem like it's part of the the, yeah. the trick you know what i mean right so you've not had any big blunders but that's what any performance not really. act or are you a chess player yeah that's any yeah, performance, chess. Right? we'll have a game that's how i can get one back on him no don't play yeah. don't play chess against the magician 
That's yeah. asking for trouble. Yeah. Josh, you're not going to win. Well, I, I, He'll yeah. just pull out the queen. Yeah, well... Yeah, we'll, yeah, we'll pull it off the board. That's yeah. the trick. I got snap, 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 and all the pawns turned to queen. Well, he just so snapped got... me, and uh, I don't know what happened, but yeah. he, he tricked me. Yeah, he I did. Me. I did. I hypnotized him. So, Dan, I got, <laughs> actually, actually, I got a question for you. This is not related, really, to your magic tricks, okay. but uh, we were doing some research on you before you came here, right? Yeah. It said something that you'd been on Char Charlie the Choc Chocolate Factory? Oh, yeah. Um, what is that about? Have you, are you a movie star? Um, I was the first ever. I'm also, obviously I'm a magician, but I'm also a time traveler. So I... Uh, Wait, what? No, no. Um, no, I just did the, the West End musical. Um, the, the West End musical? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So right. in, um, in Jury Lane Theatre, what, Royal, but Royal, Royal, Royal. Is that like Royal. a theatre or something? Ba -da -ba -da. Yeah, theatre in uh, Covent Garden. Oh, all so, right. Yeah, when I was like, I, I did acting before I got into magic. And when oh. I was like 13, um, I... I was in Charlie and the Chocolate Factory. So what? So Wait, the musical. That, the musical. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, all right. So all I played right. Mike TV. So I lived in London. Did for you sing? Yeah. I, <laughs> uh, I think there was one part where I had to sing a bit of something. Yeah. Can you do that now? Yeah, absolutely. What, what do you want me to sing? The, the Charlie and Chocolate Factory. <clears throat> absolutely not. Listen, <laughs> I was like, since you are so nicely, you can go in. No. Um, so that I, had nothing to do with magic. This was pre well, to be fair, your I had, magic I had career. A, I had a squeaky voice then. So squeak, squeak. Like, Exactly. So it was easy to sing. Like mm. any little kid can can sing a high note, but now it yeah. It You've would, lost that talent. It, I've lost the talent. Right. I don't think the talent was ever there. Oh. So like so I, I guess I've I've lost nothing, but it's also it's definitely not sharpened. So, so have you ever done like a tour? Because you know, you you've got essentially a background of being in theater. You're a magician. I did one You're performing. Where where are the tours, man? Where can I buy my tickets? Yeah, 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 exactly. No, I um I I left it. When I do a proper tour I, Bring you guys along. Oh really yes. But when I so when I saw you last, you were talking about doing some stuff in the states. Yeah, um, I've just come back actually. I we're working on a Hulu oh. show. Oh, um, what? One, which were really fun. Yes. Yeah, so uh, so what, what is you can the, say that? What do you do? Yeah, in, what do you do that. in okay. the in the in the show? Magic, don't right? magic. Yeah, 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 but like, what's the thing? <laughs> yeah. How long have you been we've, sitting in it for? We've man? all seen a magic <laughs> show before. Like, what, right, what is right. the the show concept? What's the catch? Yeah. Um. So basically, in this show, um, people like. They asked me how I would use magic to like get out of a sticky situation. Ooh, and it's it's, it's just a special a short vid, right. a short thing. But uh, so say like someone might write in and say, if I wanted to do this with magic, da 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 da, what would you do? And I'd be like, well, I'd try a bit like the pickpocketing thing. Like how would yeah. you use magic in like a mischievous sort of way? Uh, okay. Which is what I'm trying to implement more. You know, trying to see how I can bend. I've got an idea. So what about a show where you have to commit every crime? With magic, yeah, I think that's a good idea. Breaking what? laws with magic. No, no. What's with this guy? That could crimes? be a, that could be a great YouTube video as well. Yeah. Oh yeah. Commit seeing how much magic I. No, how many crimes I can commit using magic <laughs> in twenty four hours with a thumbnail of a shocked face and Josh I've, in the background. I've, I've seen arrested. a video in the, recorded in the UK about weird laws that the UK has. There's there's videos on this. This could be easy. You yeah. don't even have to be a magician. Mate, it's it's. It's gonna happen very soon. I'm, so when? So when's it, when? When's your show coming? Yeah, when's this coming out? out? Uh, I'm not sure at the minute, but oh, okay. at some point this year, right. hopefully. And then, yeah, but in terms of there are there are the they the Hulu know about the show, right? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah no, they don't know about it. Yet. Just walked over there and <laughs> Yo, what's up, Hulu? Still pitching it. No, um, and then I want to do a tour eventually. But I want to, like, I really want to, for the next few years, start making long form and storytelling. Right. Yeah, so back to where, what I was saying before. So I made a ton of viral vids, which is good because a lot of people have seen my magic and they've seen, they've yeah. seen that. But now every video that I want to post from now on, uh, and even if it's silly and it's not like, I just want it to tell some sort of a story. Right. Because long term, that's so much more, like, beneficial. So, so how do you do that in short form content? Well, I'm gonna do long as well. So you are but, because you got popular as someone who who's, yeah. who's creating shorts which, and TikToks. Which, which I'm actually like. So I think other long form YouTubers will look at it like, oh well, it's shorts, it's finger. But I think some people who make shorts sometimes they might not know how to make long. Mm. I think if you can start with shorts and then eventually transition into long, sure, at a high level, then long term it looks good for the um, because you've had that global exposure of people seeing you. Because even me, like. I get recognized in other countries. Like um, when I go to America, people are like, oh, he's the magician. When I go to like even places like Jamaica, 
and like loads of just yeah. what did you do in Jamaica no, nothing <laughs> I, that's my oh, tip okay. <laughs> because it's nothing the, nothing and, mate and, and it might not be as strong as say for example if there's a U- YouTuber in the UK who has like a million subs but they're sure. very loyal primary UK yeah, yeah. I think if I can eventually get that as well then I've built something really cool because then I've got that face that people can remember mm. in so, what, so what sort, sort of long form content are you planning on doing because and you already have some long form content yeah, on youtube but it was right? just like i just filmed it on my phone and it, just it doesn't tell it. that story no no it just like you want to tell i just threw it up because i'm still um this is why some people don't know like i got to 20 mil just editing on my phone like I still, what yeah i still do it all on my phone dude so this guy he get, he has 20 million subs and you've done it all on one phone he doesn't yeah. have an editor no I what I no but I'm telling you, people need to understand this because some people who want to get into YouTube, they spend way too much money on crazy equipment, yeah, right? Uh, don't they don't it. have any source I of only revenue. I just bought a camera recently. My, lo- my long form videos. <laughs> He's got are... 50 billion views yeah. and only just bought a Wait, camera. And you, know, you know the funny thing about the camera? So <laughs> the, the, the second time I saw Dan right. was at the Brit Awards. Yeah. The Brit yeah, Awards. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So we were both invited to the Brit Awards. By YouTube. We're moving up in the world. Um, sorry, Jelly. So, and, not, and funnily enough, Brit. we were we were lining up outside, and right. for some reason, I was holding Dan's camera, <laughs> this new camera. Yeah. And we walked in, and the first thing they said is, "You can't have that camera." Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so they just took it away. Wait, so, wait. Did you ever get it back? No. What? Back. No, I did. I did when I was oh, walking did. out. Oh, I got oh. it back. But <laughs> hey. Good bit of kit in it. Nice little camera. Well, well, okay, well, I, I can't remember. A good bit of kit. Yeah. I've never heard anybody say that. To be honest with you, it probably does the exact same as the phone. Yeah, yeah exactly. you know, that's well, the thing about cameras these days, man. Yeah. Well, to be fair, like all my long form vids, I went, well, I say all, I've got about five long form vids, but uh, they, they was all filmed on my phone. Yeah. But I just think uh, now if I can get the thumbnail, the idea, the title, I can get some really good long forms. So right, right. And, uh, I've got quite a few ideas written down. But I, what I like now is that in the past, I was just going for mad consistency. Like yeah. at one point, I was posting five shots a day. Now, because I'm, I'm luckily in a position where like um, I've earned money from it, and like I'm, I'm in no rush to like grow as fast as I yeah. can. Yeah, I'm excited that I can take my time with them. So mm-hmm. with the long form and the short stuff, I just want to focus on quality now and just post that. And I think so, over a long period of time, um, it's going to work. So you mentioned money. Yeah, I don't want to get into this too too crazy. Yeah, all right, but not as much shorts, as these two guys. Shorts, shorts, short yeah. form content is yeah. known to not create as much revenue as long form content. Yeah, that's why more most people who blow up on shorts, uh, they they tend to switch to long form or do it on the side. Yeah, but uh, YouTube recently has released their new. Uh, advertising system for short creative short yeah. content right yeah I'm, I'm trying i'm struggling to explain this because i don't even know how it works yeah how how is that for you now because before youtube was funding this all these short creators right they were just yeah. they were just basically printing money yeah well they weren't but you know what i mean they were yeah. no, no, no. they were they were spreading it out and now there's ads on shorts yeah. do you see a massive difference yeah um i don't want to bite the hand that feeds me right <laughs> but it's actually like lower now Oh I'm no! Really? Bit, yeah, but I think it might have something to do that. A lot of my vids, like the viral ones, um, they had copyrighted music, mm. so it might be a bit of something. Yep. So, but okay. like I, I've had the same experience from a few people that I know saying that. Wait, well, other other wait, short wait, 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 wait. Yeah. shorts can have copyright claims. Yeah, yeah, I didn't know that. Yeah, well, as of now, but um, it's weird. Yeah, because of the recent advertising. I guess so thing. yeah, yeah, yeah. So um, yeah, I've, I've I haven't seen a mass. I'm, I, Obviously, still very new. So it yeah, might, they're, they're uh, saying that it's going to up it, over time. It's a long-term process. But yeah. but I'm not then as fussed again. because now it's like... Um, so, yeah, I, I know what your question is. To answer, to answer your question, um, basically, I've been lucky where, like, in the last couple of years, my main source of income hasn't been um, just uh, content. So, right. like, I've made a, you know, a bit of money from Snapchat and YouTube. and Because yeah. the, um, there was bonuses on shorts. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And I, I think it's fine to say this, but, like, it was not... Well... I was about to say not an insane amount. It's still a decent amount. Um, it was always capped at like thirty thousand dollars a month, mm-hmm. and obviously for like ten months, I would always hit that cap because of just the based on the views. And then there's a cap on for, short. For bonuses. It, it was the bo- back when it what? was back when it was bonuses. Yeah. So no, if you get a billion views a month or three hundred yeah, billion yeah, yeah, views yeah, a month, it doesn't really matter. But um, but then I do um, I've done like branded deals, and then like um, like I perform at events. So right. so how no, so so that. now yeah. that youtubers switched it to you know you make advertising revenue like do you do you think you can reveal how much you would make on a short now 
I'm not actually roughly. sure, to be honest. I haven't mega deep dived into it because it really So do you, do you have like one short that's made a significant amount of money on its own? I, not really, no. I mean, no. I believe. So, no. so is it maximum of like 30,000? I'm happy make? to share for me. I mean, it's like two cents per thousand views or a cent per thousand really? views. Yeah, but yeah. I'm not interested in you because you don't have the insane amount of views on shorts. Well, I got yeah. some shorts for views. Nothing yeah. like his, and, and, but... But I'm not like... Because now I'm thinking because I don't... So obviously I'm on 20 mil now. And it might now take like two or two or three years even to get to thirty mil. Yeah, no dollars. Because uh, dollars exactly. Uh, no, fifty million billion gazillion. <laughs> I'm, I'm I'm the world's richest magician. <laughs> oh, right. yeah, yeah, I invested in this uh, crypto coin, <laughs> but it was it was magic coin. We traded it with wizards. It was oh. called uh, it was called um, Slytherin. This is not Slivering. financial advice. Yeah, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> This is not this financial. This is also not <laughs> well, sane trying... people talking. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Imagine we are. Uh, it's a magician safety. talking, all right? I always think this. Are we crazy or is everyone else crazy? What? Is in we being YouTubers? Yeah, yeah, This yeah. is the most random question I've, I've always said that, like, to become a YouTuber... You have to be odd. You have to be kind of crazy, yeah. yeah. I wouldn't say crazy. We're having a water set. We're not, Josh, well, I wouldn't done, say crazy. What have you done to it? Nothing. I think just as podcasting professionals, we need a, we need a sip. Yeah, a quick rinse. Mm -hmm. No, but uh, seriously, Josh, I wouldn't say that we are all crazy because we turn out to be YouTubers. Yeah. But you do need to be a little bit oh, no, you different. Did you just drink that? Oh, he peed in it. No, no, I'm just messing. <laughs> Don't look on it. I finally got it back for the... Uh, <laughs> for Valencia. Even if it was one second. How long ago was that? How long did it take you now? Uh, six months, was it? Tastes no, like no. rat poison. How do you know? You know that kills people too, like? right? Oh, I microdose. Rat, rat poison, poison <laughs> kills people. Kills. How does he know this? I'm really getting worried Well, then now why would this. they call it rat poison? Josh. They should call it everyone poison. Mm-hmm. It should actually. <laughs> oh, just, actually. Why not just poison? Well, exactly. That's the point. <laughs> it could be argued. I've been eating rat poison for ages because I thought it was only poison for I rats. Actually, yeah, actually, I have a story about rat poison. This is kind of off topic, but I have a story I think about rat poison. No, it's on topic. It, so it goes in perfect. Okay, me, me, and my girlfriend. We were about to go on holiday, right? And um, uh, I was taking out my dog. Uh, the dog was loose in the garden. Blah blah blah. Long story short, my dog. Pooped. Okay. Okay. <laughs> it, as, it's it's um, as dogs don't do. I don't usually look at my dog's poo, but right. sometimes when it catches the eye, you have a quick glance. What happens when you're taking it on a walk? Hang on, hang on. I look at the, my dog's poo all the time. To pick it up. You don't pick up your dog's poo. Somebody Depends where I am. Poo. All right. All right. Listen, listen. Her poop, my dog's poo. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. No. Was blue, Josh. It blue. was blue. Okay, right. and that's because uh, we we didn't know why at the time, but yeah. apparently the gardener had 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 been spreading rat poison all over the yard. Oh no! Yep, and our dog ate it because oh. rat poison. But it was fine. It's tasty for rats, although they don't eat it. Yeah. However, they put a, a coloring in it, food food coloring. Yeah. Because if babies eat it or dogs eat it, you'll see it Indicator. in their feces. Yeah. But it doesn't matter because it's only poisonous to rats. Well, here's the thing. We Here's immediately. I was about to well, leave. I was about to leave, and we were like, we were told like, oh, she's gonna be fine. We should, we'll bring her to the vet to have her checked out. We were like, okay, yeah, fine. We'll, we'll we'll go on our trip. So actually, we had somebody taking care of the dogs, and um, they did a blood test on her, right. and it was killing her. Mm. Oh, okay. it was killing her. Did your dog survive? The, my dog survived. We don't know. It, uh, we have to give her like medicine. It, it's basically vitamin K supplements. How much did the dog eat? Uh, we don't know. Right. Was, we don't know. He wasn't watching his dog cat. So what, what I mean says he doesn't look at his dog's pee. He just doesn't watch his dog. But do you know what rat? Do you know what it does? It 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 like disables organs. So yeah, I know. over time, um, it just. I have a friend that they die at one out one after one. You yeah, know? it's so sad. But I have a friend that told me that um, there was some guy who was like escaped um, an asylum. And he got, yes. yeah, and he got loads of Windex <laughs> or the thing, that, the thing that you put on uh, your car, yeah. freezer, whatever. Or glass. Yeah, yeah. Or whatever it is, defroster. Yeah, yeah. The, oh, put yeah. it on loads of meat and they were throwing it over people's gardens and a bunch of dogs ate it and they did the same thing where it went, insides went. Blue. But then it doesn't have the coloring, so they didn't find out and the dogs and died. And it did. It, apparently it was vomiting blue. So I don't know what oh. this contrast is with uh, right. 
the color blue. Well, the contrast is blue. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> the exactly. The on the topic of and blue. consuming interesting things. Yeah. So obviously, there's a big trend with magicians. You're gonna like this. You're gonna like this. Ooh. There's a big trend with magicians. Like they like eat stuff. Like I've seen them yeah. eat goldfishes and like frogs and stuff. Like, do you have any idea how that works when they do that? Like David Blaine does it, right? Yeah. Oh, I've seen this. But he just swallows a frog and leaves it in there for ten hours. But he actually does it. That's what's insane. It's not right? magic. It's, not a trick. it's real. Like, is, is that magic then? So he swallows a, a, a lot of a lot of water, so I, the, fro the frog survives. Yeah, yeah. He drinks like bottles of bottles of water. He's learned how to. I've got a friend called yes. Karen. Karen. My friend. I've got a, a video I did with this guy called Karen, who's yeah. also. If you type in human regurgitator, okay. I've got a short video mm -hmm. where I'm like, "This is Karen," and it shows him just. <laughs> Loads of water out of the They can launch water out of their stomachs. They can. They can puke on command. Josh, yeah. can you puke on command? Not at all. I could at the start of this video. Which one? Oh, yeah. We, we did the thing with the yeah. paper. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, we did. We, Which we, one? <laughs> yeah. Which one was that? No, this this one. This one. Um, see, like, the David Blaine thing is like an ability. Yeah. This one is... Um, so I watched, is that, I watched you, the video on that. He actually went somewhere special. Oh, he... he, he he learned about this one guy that has this ability to puke on command, basically. Yeah. And he tried to find this guy. He met him and had a whole training together yeah. with this so guy. It's, so it's a skill you can learn. It's not, a skill not you can learn. You just have yeah, but it's, to throw it's, very, it's very dangerous. Like, because your actually, stomachs can come out. Yeah, your stomachs. And not only that, um, you can't eat before. So, like, David Blaine did a show in Manchester that I watched. And before the show, he can't eat for 24 hours because essentially you're being sick. But if you've got no food and you drink loads of water, then you can bring wow. it up. Wow. So I, I can't imagine his breath is very nice. Yeah, no. no I've met him. I've you've, you've met stunk, him? man. It was... No, I've never <laughs> met him. I've never <laughs> met Dave Blaine, but I really want him. Who's, who's your... Um, who's, like, your, your favorite magician? Right. Who's your idol? My idol. Josh. Oh. He's not I'm a just, magician. Yeah, but, like, uh, he kind of is. I've been teaching him a couple of tricks, and now he's... Uh, Told me that he's leaving you for the game and stuff to be, pursue a career in magic. Well, he's stuck here with me now on two thirds. Yeah, exactly. Well, yeah. He's, this is what I mean. He's doing card tricks for the guests now. Ah, Josh, can you show me a card trick? Mm -hmm. Do you want to give me some cards? All right. So Slogo apparently is a magician. Oh, I get, I get the little box. Okay. So close your eyes, Jelly. Why do I need to close my close eyes? Close your eyes. It's all part. Right, wait, of it. I'm gonna, I'm gonna put the cap on my bottle. I'm scared. Can I, can I open them again? I've got my eyes closed. Okay. What All are you right. doing? Okay, Jelly. Is there something around me? Jelly. Oh, you're still at your mic. I can hear that. Jelly, I'm here. Just open your eyes. Oh, okay. Yeah. I want you yeah. to guess a card. Okay? A card in this deck. All right. It can be whatever you want. It can be any card in the deck. Six of diamonds. It can be any card except for the six of diamonds. Seven any, of diamonds. Any person that you could think of? Dan? Right, I, I, I'll explain. So, in a pack of cards, we've got red cards and black cards, right? Yeah, yeah. Imagine there's another box here and you're picking one up, the red or the black, which ones? But the red is on the black? Excuse me, no, what no, did you say? There's red cards and black cards on the table. Yeah. Which ones are you taking off the table? Uh, depends on my mood. Which <laughs> colour, Jelly? Red. red. You're taking the red ones off? Yes. Right, I want you, Josh, to spread the black cards on the table and you're going to throw to a gel. Actually, you can decide what he's throwing to you. Is he throwing your number cards or picture cards? Number. Number cards. Right. I am confused. So take what out is all happening? the red numbers, right? Is this an no, actual black, magic trick? It's black, so you're left with Jack, Queen, King. Okay, okay. Right? Yep. That's going to take you a little while, Jack, man. Queen, King. Uh, of what of color? Clubs. Well, the black, aren't they? So. Oh, yeah. You wanted the black, Jelly, okay? Name one. Jack, no, I wanted the red. Jack, no, no Queen, you were Jack, taking them out, though. Oh. Just say one. One of the two, the Jack, Queen, the King. Two of them. King. King of what? Clubs? Diamond. No, no, we... We got black cards. Clovers. We asked you what oh, color. Uh, it's oh, clubs. clubs. Yeah, sure. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. King of clubs. You said the king of clubs. I feel like I'm I'm an absolute terrible guest to this Okay, manager. I mean, I've I've tried to pick them all out, but I appear, You're to, just gonna... I appear to be missing one. This is the world's longest magic trick. Congratulations, But you guys. put clubs in my mouth. I did. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I did. I'm, I'm missing I'm missing one. Which one? Which are you... Is that the one that Jelly said? No, he said the king of clubs. You've messed up, man. Uh, <laughs> hang on. You've still got a I lot what, to learn, Slogo. Uh, oh, no. Is that the king of clubs? No. 
What is he doing? Is that the king clubs? He's no. doing the magic trick. Dan just took How over the trick. This? We're, we're, we're in this cahoots. It? No. I, I feel like they're working together. Did you pay him that 20 grand? Yes. Perfect. <clears throat> was was that yes to me? Oh, hang on, hang on. Oh, oh. Got it's a little gone. bit of a stain there, mate. It's gone. <laughs> Where'd it go, Jelly? Jelly, check your back pocket. No, you're kidding. You check there. <laughs> check your back pocket, Jelly. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! How does that happen? <laughs> How is that? How? Who it's knows? magic. How Ooh. did you just put a card there? How? Who knows? See, I told you I was doing a trick. All right, the cameras just, uh, must have caught that. It just took me a while to get there. Okay? The cameras must have caught that trick. At I least... will rewatch this entire episode just for that, and just I will find that. out exactly how you did it. I mean, it, it was my trick. It was hit. Yeah, yeah, blame him. Oh, really? How did Dan, you get that my from your seat? All right, how did you get the card? I, I had the card. Is that why I had to close my eyes? No. But why would you even insinuate that? <laughs> it's just it's just rude. I asked you to close your eyes, <laughs> It's Jenny. just rude. I asked you to close your eyes. All right, all right. Can yeah, you catch this card? Still got it. <laughs> Got him. Okay. Got him. <laughs> okay. All right, all right. Sorry, Josh. I am clearly a terrible magician. No, uh, you did actually. To be fair, you haven't had much practice. You did before we started recording. You were like, "Hey, mate, I've got your hey, pack mate. of cards here." <laughs> yes. This that's, one's yours. That's this... my pack of cards. They're for you. You keep them. I have just been gifted a pack of cards. A pack of by cards. a real life Hogwarts magician. Hogwarts magician, friends with Harry Potter. Right. Um. Yeah, that's why. What, what are you doing at the moment? I'm opening it. Okay, it was a gift. Okay, while gift. Oh, oh my, gonna, it was a gift. It's gonna break everything. While while Jelly's working on that, <laughs> yeah. I so I, you released a book. Yeah, what you did? <laughs> <laughs> I did. You could tell. Did you who snap does your fingers research. and it was done? Yes, it was. Um, that's what I me. Mean. I didn't have to write it. It was just like bang, 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 a book. <laughs> what was what was the thought process around making the book? Like, what you just? Uh, I just wanted to like. Um, teach magic in a book you know Whoa. because obviously i feel like ma uh videos they're cool and like they're where the future is but kids don't read as much anymore and i when i was learning my youtube vids someone bought me a magic book and it was just quite interesting it was a different way of learning because you get your own interpretation of it so mm. that's why i wanted to do a book and and it, was that quite successful for you yeah yeah i did yeah. pretty well and to be honest with you i did a lot of tours around the book so ah, i did um, okay I did um, ten, 10 different shows. Yeah, yeah. So you've kind oh, of yeah. done shows before. Yeah, but yeah, yeah. That's, what, I, that's what I was going to say with the tour thing. Yeah, so I did, um, I was doing um, a lot of seats with the tours and the, the best one, um, um, we had one where 700 people came. So nice. Came the show and then we signed a, uh, signed a bunch after. So yeah. Wow. It was, uh, it was fun. So yeah. I need to send you a book as well. Yeah. Tosh, where's your tricks. book? I don't have a book. You do you have a book? No, I don't have a book. You did. You were gonna have a book. I right? was working on a book. <laughs> what happened? I for, what what <laughs> happened? To that? So long story short, I was working on a book. Yeah, yeah. I. I and then they realized this. He's not interested. <laughs> <laughs> at all. They realized they couldn't read. So it was I just don't like... exactly remember, but I think the producer pulled out. I I don't. Oh really? Know. Yeah, yeah. Jenny, yeah. can you please stop touching the microphone? You're gonna tip the table over. I'm sorry. When we were saying, why did you get me up? such a wonky table? Okay. You okay. know. Okay. Okay. I actually blame Josh on this one. I mean, yeah, you know, don't blame the. But Jenny, you see, so you actually, you actually had a book though. It wasn't you promoted it. No. Oh, it was, so so the book wasn't written by the time I promoted it. Right. So no, why did you? The not, idea did was you, there. Did you just didn't get around to writing it? I think the idea with, uh, I think I think the idea with promoting <laughs> it was to see how much effort. Oh no no, see, to see how much interest there was going to be in the book. Yeah. Right. That's why we started promoting it, and that's when the producer pulled out. Right. No, I actually don't know why they pulled out. I, I can't remember. This is years ago. Five. Are years you sure ago. it's got nothing to do with the fact that you don't know how to write uh, or read? Well, the the whole idea was that I was going to have calls with a writer, and 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 you know we would we would talk about certain things, and that would eventually get written by who? I don't remember who. By you. Oh no no no! I wouldn't be the one physically writing. Right. Okay. The amount of spelling errors. No one could. No one. <laughs> no one could have. Did you write your book? that. Um, so I did the same thing. I worked with a ghostwriter, but um, I like he said I was a nightmare to work with because I changed. I changed. <laughs> so, so like, sounds I'd, like what happened to yeah, Jelly. Well, I'd, I'd I'd go on a Zoom with him every day for like um, like two hours, and then he would send me prints and I'd read them. I'd yeah. Read, uh -huh. like, he'd just basically write down what I said. Yeah. But I'd change so much. But like, oh, could you reword that so that we could? Yeah, yeah. yeah. And they'd get too. angry that you changed things. Yeah, because in the end, Ugh. in the end, it was literally like like 
you know, they try and... They just get paid for the job. Well, it, they try and neaten it up so it looks, it sounds more efficient. Whereas yeah. I was just like, that doesn't sound like me. Yeah. Put but Josh, that. you're kind of insinuating that there's something wrong with that. You probably oh, don't no, want to know no, how no. many books are ghostwritten. No, I'm just teasing. Or co-written. You know, like, like with all the respect, I am not a writer. Can you see me possibly write a book? But I, but I can still release a book. I, I am going somewhere with this, though. Because. Oh. oh, oh, oh. So, obviously, you didn't write your book. Do you, do you make your tricks? Because you've already said you bought a trick. Yeah. Right. Do you just hired it? Hired it. Um. So that's that's what. So basically, I think it's in the same sense of like a gu a guitarist learns how to play guitar. It's like if they write a song and they use different chords, is it their song or is it technically using something that pre exists? So my analogy is I invent my own styles of tricks, yeah. but he uses principles that are already out there in the exact same are way. Are they out there though? Hmm. What do you mean well, by out there? Like a. Like you can find them in books or YouTube videos. Because like I always think YouTube progressively gets better over the years, like content. Mm. But I think that's always because they're standing on the shoulders of giants because they have things to go off. So when I look at like certain videos, now I look at it and go, he's slightly been inspired by maybe like Mr. Beast or slightly inspired by David Dobrik. Or this has been edited in the set. So like the reason it progressively, get, like sometimes you can't compare new content to some are old because it's just evolved. So mm. like sometimes I, I was having this convo with someone the other day and it was giving me of the analogy of like an air rack video or like a yeah. Mr. Beast and comparing it to like a uh, an Alfie Day's vlog from like seven years ago. Yeah, yeah. Like, oh, oh, wow. so, I can't even watch I them now. I haven't heard like, that name for a while. Yeah, it's yeah. Slow, so slow paced. But you can't, ex you can't compare the two mm. because sure. it was all that exists at that time. So like, for example, in a few years, the content might elevate massively, but it's because they've got more to go off. So basically what you're trying to say is your tricks are... Someone uh, else's tricks. Someone else's tricks or inspired by. Not all moves, like moves that have been created already. Do you know yeah. what I mean? Like, yeah. Uh, yeah. yeah. Like a chess, you know, Each you, you, you can't make new. a new chess chess play. Yeah, exactly. Exactly. You've just got to... No, 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 no. You can make a new magic trick. What are you saying? Well, you there's, there's only like... Well, can you? No, well, there's Of only... course you can. He can just make one up right now on the spot. Here we go. Yeah, yeah. yeah. But, he's, but I think maybe you don't... The whole point is that he's saying that it's all based on existing principles of, of yeah. magic. Like, yeah, there's, yes. all, there's sleight only, of hand. There's only, like, se apparently, like, they say seven tricks in magic. Like, mind reading, making something float, making something change, making something disappear, something restore. And there's two others which I can't remember because, uh, like I said, I don't like to focus on the tricks. I'm more about the real magic. Right. Yeah. And the Guardian, story. Like, when God in Leviosa. Leviosa. Yeah. Avada Kedabra. Yeah. Oh, sorry. That was... A, that was Harsh, that was dark magic. That yeah. was. Is there? I thought you didn't bring your wand. Actually, is there a? <laughs> is there? Visible, this one. Oh, is there like a real Can life version it? of that? The dark magic. <laughs> the dark magic. Stop trying to touch the guest wand, Jelly. Here you go. Take it. <laughs> Do you feel it? Yeah. Yeah. That's quite a chunk, man. He's been bullying you all. Do something. I've too. been bullying. All right, watch this. He's gonna close his eyes. It didn't work. Didn't, didn't work. Oh, you froze him. <laughs> this is backfire. They did something. Do something else. <laughs> is there is there like a real life version of um, tricks that like are kind of frowned upon? Ooh. Oh. Well, the uh, the crime ones, I guess. <laughs> yeah. Except, but those the are cool. Pocketing. Those are cool. Like the big. Is there like a cool. real life version of that where it's like, oh, you you, and it doesn't even have to be like cr criminal stuff. Just any magic where other magicians go, oh, you do that magic. That's mm. not cool. Yeah, um, I think it's like, like reaction content on YouTube. Yeah, I think like the the, <laughs> the voodoo <laughs> stuff, really. You know, the dark, evil magic that I've been conjuring all all through the years to. Uh, so I that's guess. that's not cool. No, it's not dark it's, magic. It's a, yeah, dark magic. So, could you please give an example? I'm a dangerous of dark man. Magic. Um, you know, I, shall I show you one? I no, no, no. Yeah, no, no. You can show us some dark magic. I'm gonna, I'm gonna yeah, I'm gonna see. Josh is up for anything. Mm. Just shut up for anything. He's not like, grab a card. Another card. Oh. Any card. All right. See, you wouldn't think it'd be that scary. That it's, you know, it's a card trick, but it's very, very. very <laughs> give me, give me one on the edge, mate. Listen. Oh mate. wow. Do you, do you hate the way I say mate? It's such a northern. Mate. You probably never heard it like that, mate. Mm. Mate. Very rarely. From I can Manchester, tell you that. a bit more like mate. Pass me the card. Okay. Are you sure? Yeah, it's it's fine. All right. This is my card. That's his card. This one right here. Jelly, jelly. You can see. <laughs> Bang. He's not supposed to look. Oh, I scared you. I can see it in your eyes. Yeah, fear. you did scare me. The shock horror. All right, he's picked a card. Yes. Do you remember what it was? Did I didn't see it. Didn't I, see I, it? I, I sort of saw it. Right, I know the what. number. Well, um, if I put the card on the floor, will the camera see or no? 
Yes. Brilliant. Why Chadwick? Okay. Uh, so he's he's putting the cards on the floor. It might not be possible to be heard though. Yeah, you? yeah. Um, I'll, I'll talk. What do you do? It, it's moving around. What did you just do? That was real wizardry. That's dark magic, Jelly. Really. Dark magic. I used the Wingardium Leviosa, but without... I don't understand how that happened. So either I'm a big, a big fat liar, or I'm Harry Potter. Who knows? I'll let you guys decide. Mm. So... I'm missing the glasses. So you went from Charlie and the Chocolate Factory to Harry Potter. Yeah. <laughs> it's a, it, was a big, it was a big step Why up. Why didn't you, you sign know? up for the Harry Potter musical? Harry Potter musical. Is that not a thing? That's um, a thing, right? It was. Yeah, it is. It's funny because you say that you weren't into... Like, <laughs> one of the reasons why you didn't... You said you weren't really into the that because of the acting, right? Like into what the the, the musical stuff. Yeah, right. Yeah. You, but it's funny, isn't magician magic stuff? That's all about acting, kind of. Like yeah, I guess you kind of because what you're doing half the time you're convincing someone. Yeah, that you're a wizard. Yeah, a wizard pretty hand. much. <laughs> <laughs> but I feel like um, yeah, that's true. To be honest, like you're playing a character really. That yeah. You can, um, but I like, suppose it's a different style of acting. Yeah, I feel like it's. It's still rot. It's still genuine because you're interacting with someone, and then you go, like, it's like turn the card around, pick a card. I'm gonna find it. Like, I'm not telling you that I'm doing real wizardry, mm. but it's still sometimes your mind can't figure out how I've just done what I've done. So I've deceived the eye. Dan, how, what do you see? Like, how, what's your life in ten years from now? Ten years. Yeah, where does a magician go? Yeah, I always have this. This is the, like the craziest question because I always think people's like. Their opinions change so much about things. The mindsets change. Like yeah. the, it's such a hard question, isn't it? Because who knows what I like. Are I you? Think. Yeah, so, I mean, it's it's the same thing as us getting asked that question. Are you hoping for the success like of this long form content, and that will roll into uh, something else? Definitely. Maybe more tours, magic tours. Yeah, I think um, I'd love to do this the long form thing for a good three, four years. Mm. I know a guy. And then I know yeah, a guy. Yeah, yeah, know a guy. Does a bit fit a long form, um, and then see where it goes. Really, I'd like yeah. to do tours. You know, do you magic? So do you, and, and, and the, so the goal is to just keep building your audience. Yeah, keep right, building right. And, and make something more sustainable. So not just like viral vids. Yeah. Make stuff that tells a story really. Right. So what's, what like video has the most amount of views? Like what did you do and how many views does it have? It's just a, I, I created this concept where like, and it has just music on the vids. There's no talking. And that's the reason oh. it went so viral. Because mm. it would have crossed so many it's demographics. Yes, exactly. No, but it just yeah. started with me doing a trick. Then I got my friend to do the trick. She can't do it. Then I do a trick. She can't do it. And that got like 400 million views. And what? Yeah. And wow. I, I gained, one one yeah, video. Yeah. And I, I gained, 400 million. And I gained 1.1 million what? subscribers. 1.1 million subscribers from yeah. one video. What? Yeah. So, uh, you, know yeah. I, you know how hard I have to work for one million subscribers. Yeah. I'm not saying you did. No, no. I, no, no but, <laughs> Sounds like that's what you're saying. Agree, it, was no, one, no. it was a six Mate, second video. If I, if I, if I were doing lot, like, I would, in a way, when I hit a million subscribers on YouTube, I wasn't disappointed, but I was like, uh, I always envisioned it would have taken so much long because right. I would have done proper content. And That's it was great. one viral. Yeah, yeah. One. So I assume you tried to recreate this video many times over and over. Not really. I did the same what? concept, but I didn't oh, do the same, like, the same one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because the same concept. Then again, it's The same trick? Um, no, but it's, it's back to that thing of like, mm. what's the point if I'm not talking? Like, it's just a viral vid. Yeah. So do you think you could ever run out of magic tricks? Oh, uh, probably not. No. no, but then again, I think when I do long form, it's not all going to be about just trick, trick, sure. trick. It's more of the idea than the magic story. So, are you exactly. trying to uh, to to put more personality into? Yeah, because it's funny. You're like the complete opposite of us. So, me and Jelly have zero talent. Oh, I wouldn't say that. <laughs> and that's we not true. and we have. Why to, does he always that's bring not true. me We're, into this? So we have to just be personalities yeah. to get anywhere. Whereas you're on the opposite side of things. You have talent. And then I guess you need to now build out a personality wow. on the long form. That is actually a like, I'll, I'll, always, I'll always argue this point right now for anyone watching. Obviously, in, in, in the grand scheme of life, um, <laughs> content creating is still very new. Like, very new. Sure. Right. In any capacity, right? But, like, there are YouTubers out there that doesn't matter. Say, for example, you have a famous, you know, um, singer like Justin Bieber or something. Whatever. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No matter how long he could train like, for or practice YouTube, some people are just gifted at telling a story and being able to translate that on a, through a screen. Do you know what right. I mean? And I, Jane, but that is such a talent. And I think as the thing goes on, because sometimes I used to hear the question like, you're a YouTuber, but like, what do you do? Well, what do you, well, 
<laughs> the clues in the name. I make videos like yeah. I'm a content cool. creator, and I think there's still that fine line between. Mm -hmm. Obviously, they like to label things like a magician does magic. Yeah. A, uh, a, a singer sings songs, but I think we just need to accept like creating content is a real skill in itself. Just like in itself, like an actor is one thing, but I think for the longest time people were trying to like conceptualize. I said that word wrong. Con. You were pretty close. You were closer Almost. than Jelly's been. Yes, yes. Um, what, what it, you know, conceptualize. What, what that entails. Exactly. Well done. Uh, said it better than me. Um, but yeah, what that entails essentially. But so I think that's. Do you remember he just called YouTubers odd? Slogo called YouTubers odd. Yeah. Mm. But is us being odd or crazy our talent then? Yeah. Or you know, our talent is making us odd and crazy, probably. I think I think Probably. it's just um, doing something that's out the realms of norm because no one wants to watch something that is normal. So, Josh, yeah. we are talented, man. You're so talented. It might not feel need, like it, I but you to, have something. I need something to tell my special. mom. Yeah. I need to tell my mom that There's I wasn't a, a disappointment. There. Yeah. Oh. Because yeah. something. Yeah. And I'll tell Jerry's mom as well because I'll see her later. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. She'll be watching this, Josh. That's first embarrassing. Day. I'm sorry, <laughs> Mrs. Van Vucht. I, I <laughs> didn't mean that. Is that a second name? <laughs> what? My last name I is... I have the utmost respect yeah. for... Oh, sorry. So I'm, I'm, talking. I'm not British. I'm not English. Mm -hmm. My last name is very foreign. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. That might not be usual on this island, but... Yeah. So my last name is Van Vucht. How do I say that? Van... V yeah, go say ahead. Say again. Van Vucht. Van Vucht. Oh, yeah, it's not too bad, but you, you guys are saying the F word all the time when when you're trying to pronounce it. What? Van, Van Vucht. Yeah, Van Van Vucht. <laughs> I'm not doing that. <laughs> Actually, this is an interesting. So this is an interesting He's point. He's trying to put an accent spin on it. So is there? No. Speaking of different countries, is there differences with magic in in different countries? Like magicians, do they do in North different Korea? I heard they have this trick where people actually disappear. That is true. <laughs> we'll have to cut that. <laughs> no, it stays in. That's the, yeah, welcome to the. That's it. He's cancelled himself. Yeah. No, no it, going back from there. Yeah, it's honestly this podcast no, you're is not. A slippery slope. <laughs> this should be like, oh, I thought of the best idea for a podcast. Like it could be called cancelled or something. And like the whole aim is to go on and just say at least one thing that gets them cancelled. This and, is and, hilarious. And, and if they can survive, then like it's. Uh, you should hear what Jelly's girlfriend suggested that we should name our podcast. I don't remember exactly, but basically she said two thirds is too boring of a name. So why I don't like you it. call it Dead YouTubers? <laughs> and it was like I was like, tell me how you really feel. Dead just, YouTubers. Like, we could have gone with no, no, cancelled no. YouTubers. Also, but... irrelevant? Irrelevance. 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 But then no guests would want to sit here. Hi yeah. <laughs> <laughs> right, guys, do you want to come on a podcast? I say irrelevant. Yeah, if, because if that's we, what you are. If we had a podcast called Dead YouTubers and we invited you, yeah. how would that make you feel? Like, I would, it... I'd be like, fair. You know, <laughs> you, gotta, you, you, know you couldn't you, you could get any long form proper YouTubers. You had to get a shorts magician. I mean, that's right. a, So how do you feel about our name now? Two thirds. You know what? Does it make sense to you? Because I'm not sure if you grew up watching our content or our seeing our content. Does it make sense? Do you know uh, why? It doesn't, it's, but it's, it doesn't need to make sense because Dan is... He's the third I'm, right uh, now. Yeah. I'm starting a podcast at some point. And can I just say what the name is just right yeah, now? Because no one else has got it. So no one can steal it. Um, I'm going to call it... That's how it works. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I, well, I, I'm copywriting it here. Here we go. Shuffling. I think that's quite good. Because it goes with magic Shuffle well. in? Shuffling. Shuffle oh. in. Just shuffling. Shuffling what? Well, cards or dancing, you know, it means uh, can mean many shuffling? things. <laughs> Every day I'm shuffling, and that's the, the theme music. Careful, yeah. could be copyrighted. Yeah, oh, damn, that's true. Well, that was a scoop there. That mm. was what was I asking that I, I was actually interested in? Yeah, it was onto something. It, no, about, about the two-thirds then... name. No, no you, no, you went off on a tangent. Well, well, oh, oh, yeah, yeah, the differences in countries. Oh, yeah. Like, is there different yeah. magic between different countries? Uh, I don't think so. No. Okay, never mind. Moving on. And, um, <laughs> and, uh, yeah. I don't know. I don't know if there is different. Uh, Thanks, Dan. Different I'm magic. sure there is. I'm sure there is. Uh, I think there's like In different parts of the world, different I was, cultures. I was really hoping that there was like some like. Wait, but there's like there's like some some rituals in some cultures that yeah could, could yeah. be considered magic tricks, right? The dark magic, like you were saying. Well, oh, like Jesus walking on water. I did that. Where are you going? He did that in a video. You did, did you that. See it? You've walked yeah. on water. No, I just saw it and I didn't click it. 
<laughs> I, but I, I saw it when I was scrolling through. I see where we stand. That's how we do research on our <laughs> guests. Where... That's how we do research on but our guests. I'm sure there was one on there. His videos arrived with just ads, and I click. <laughs> I've, I've probably made you at least more a than pound. you've made on a show. Yeah, exactly. More than I've made in my one billion views. <laughs> In what, now I want to take my view back. <laughs> he can't click on a short and I click on his long videos. Uh, uh, look, you see the difference? So you here? actually clicked on a slogo video because not a I'd, lot of people do that. Okay. I'd, exactly. I think it's... Um, I regretted the decision <laughs> immediately after. Really? But then again... Did it give you a virus? Give, yeah, it, it, it destroyed my computer. It was... Uh, <laughs> It was like... Well, the virus Jenny gave me destroyed my anus. <laughs> <laughs> that is getting clipped. 10 million views. Um, uh, well, how did you walk on water then? Just tell me, for someone who didn't watch it, what was well, that? Well, Josh, it kind of Terrible. says it, doesn't it? He? he just walked on water. Oh, yeah. Jesus did, did it, so why couldn't he? I'll tell you what I did. So I hyped up the video that I was going to walk on like a pool. A, what? Got... a pool. A pool. <laughs> a pool. That's pretty cool. <laughs> yeah, I'm sorry. You... So Je Jelly, Jelly does. The... Jelly takes the piss out of me all the time Dude, when I say water. I'm a foreigner. Water. I can I can make fun of accents. Listen, mate. All right, my water. accent is perfect. A push London boy. Should we? We're gonna get there at some point soon. Go ahead. Walking on water. Yeah. So I just got a bottle of water and I just put it on the floor. Water, water. I just walked on the water. I'm glad I didn't click it. Is that Te actually technically? I did it. Yeah, I wasted what? everyone's time. You didn't put like an in, yeah, like, like a transparent box jelly, in jelly, a pool. Jelly, 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 stand on this. You've oh, stand just on what? this. Stand oh, on oh, okay. It. Stand right. on this. All right, all right, all right. And then you will be watch everyone where jelly is. The, is the bottle on camera? Yep. Is are you sure it's not gonna explode? I, I hope not. You just walked you are on now. What? You're now standing on water. You know there used to be a trick. I know one can hear you, Jelly. You can. Yeah. No, no, do 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 fuck fuck. Bye. Aiming at our cameras. <laughs> we spent a lot of money on that. We've not made any money yeah. from this. Oh, we're talking about making money. Yeah, wait till season two before you start wrecking oh, the Oh, actually, yeah. that's a good question. Do you know anyone that could, that could sponsor us? Yeah. Sponsor the podcast. Yeah. yeah. We got this guy. Mm. Who could sponsor? Wait, a rock. Wait, what is a this? rock? Oh, a fair. The is rock. It's not this, the rock. Is this an official sponsor? Yeah. Uh, yes. He's really? called. He's called our Roman hero. They sell uh, ro Romans. Mm. We are actually so we so this is our this is our merch for the podcast. So we sell just oh. just this one. Yeah, this right. just this one here is for sale. That's how. Just so basically, yeah. long story uh, short, this price ninety nine. Oh, I didn't even know. It was I haven't decided what it's ninety nine off yet. Crypto oh, okay. cryptocurrency, Slytherin. So if it's uh, if it's ninety nine pounds. I'm screwed. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> He's going to have to make billion another views. billion views for it. Yeah. Right, so a staff member basically thought that it looked like two thirds of a head. Oh, okay. yeah. oh I'm, I think it looks... That didn't that work. I think sense. it's a bit of a stretch. No, that's one head. Like, <laughs> no. That's half a head. How's it two thirds? Like two thirds of a head. Like it's... I it's think we're getting third. off topic now. Yeah. The, um, okay. So <laughs> closing this up then. Dan, I, 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 wanna, okay. I want you to be quiet. I want Dan to... <laughs> that was harsh. It was, wasn't it? That I was a shock. 50% of the show. I know. <laughs> you know? You're one third one of the third. show. Wait, so as every guest comes on, they become a third. Nailed it! Although you don't no, no, get a third of the revenue. No, it becomes a full. Yeah, and also you've signed the agreement yeah, that said you don't get you any money. You don't get any money. Oh, no, no. No. Even if we had sponsors, you're not making, you're not making a sad. buck, mate. So, the I want to know... The magician who makes £10 per billion views... <laughs> Get paid for it. <laughs> Tell us a fun fact about yourself, Dan. A fun fact about me, like something that so, uh, something that no one viewing will know. Ah, something that the not... whole point of this is to get you his parts you don't off. smell. Stop feeding him. What stuff. something for the art? Some something juicy that no one. Yeah, knows. something that nobody would ever know. Um, I'm gonna make this a thing now to ask people, Jelly, because then they get all confused. And you're gonna like worried. interrupt me so, each time. Something not. Behave. I, I just tell the audience because nobody knew where we're filming this right now. Can't say the exact location, <laughs> but, uh, but funnily enough, my ex girlfriend lived here, <laughs> who no one knows. So it was very random when Josh said, "Come and film a podcast here," because she lives five minutes from here. Which you're is seeing her after, and I'll actually no. no. So bring her in. 
<laughs> Fuck. <laughs> Imagine. <laughs> Imagine. Dude, I actually, you got me there as well for a second. Imagine, she Jenny, was, you are a be, host on this podcast. That would have been such trick. a good magic trick. Yeah. Right? Check your back pocket. She's in your pocket. Yeah, you've shrunk her. You've got a ray gun and bum. And then another fun fact. Um, what's something else nobody knows about me? Um, when I was younger, I used to collect coins. That's like the most random thing. But I don't think anybody cared. No, no, people really care. There's people, <laughs> yeah. there's people behind the screen crying because I opened up so much to them. Did you pickpocket oh, other up. people's coins for your own collection? Oh, that's what he means. He used to collect uh, coins. I collect did. coins. coins I coins. used to collect people's wallets. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 I had a wallet collection. And, uh, ID cards well, and credit fair, cards. I, and... I don't see it as stealing because I would throw... Before I used to pickpocket someone and take the wallet, I would throw a coin into a fountain and, and, and my wish would be that a wallet would come to fruition for me so. well i um i what? hope that one day that can come to fruition for you thank but anyway you, thank you very much thanks for having me our podcast uh, and, thanks uh, for letting me come on you can you can you can leave now yeah thank you i've been waiting do like know. a magic spoof a like spoof. and it leaves yeah, the ready, crowd ready okay. ready thank you for allowing me to come on the podcast it's been good whoa where did he go he's gone i can uh, see him you still. gotta click the button to open the door yeah the door's oh, locked okay. oh yeah, it's yeah. a bit awkward. Goodbye, fellas. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I'm a fella now. <laughs>